I don't know what I'm doing. Hang on, rewind. I am not a professional. <laughs> but I got plaster on. <laughs> Paper roll plane. We Googled the most common how-to questions. We'd like to ask you, can you show us how to make a paper aeroplane? Oh, yeah, I'm, I don't know what I'm doing. I haven't made a paper aeroplane since I've been a child. I have no idea. I only know people start by doing this. It's hard without a table. Ha, huh, easy. You want a fast one or you want a spinny one? I used to do professional airplanes. I mean, I was really good at doing airplanes, but I've lost it. So you make a bit of a triangle on both sides. So you just have to fold it, I think, three times, exactly from the middle. Do some wings. Paper roll plane. I remember that I was playing when I was a kid. Brings me all the way back to school. You can do this also because it's a bit more aerodynamically pleasant for the air. I feel like everyone knows how to make a paper airplane, do they not? I'm middling the Concorde. What have I done wrong here? Hang on. Rewind. I think you go one further, don't you? You go one further? Here we go. The wings. Beautiful wings. I'm doing a very fast one, so it's done. <laughs> This is it. And then grab it by the middle, and here you have your paper airplane. I remember people would always go, like that. It's <laughs> okay, no? That's excellent. It goes all the way to the end, easy. <laughs> <laughs> oh, it glided. <laughs> I don't know if you can call that gliding. Sort of uh, flew. Give it a go. Whoa. Very good, that's excellent. We wonder whether you could show us how to use some chopsticks. Uh, I'm not a good teacher. I am not a professional. I use it a little bit different to a normal like Chinese people. I just do like this. So I put my thumb in between. They normally have it like that. So, but I does it just my way because I find it easy. And here I go. <laughs> <laughs> so you have your three fingers behind just for like uh, to make the chopstick stable and then you use basically the these two fingers that control the movement so you can pick whatever items you want to eat can you show us how to tie a tie <laughs> you want to measure both ends i've done that not too long ago so i need to cross it i don't know i might be a bit out with the length here I was on a pretty basic school, you know, so. Get the bigger one, flip it over, mm, go underneath, go through. Underneath, mm. you pull it through. And then you pull mm. it. Mm. <laughs> and then. Something like that. It's not the best knot, but look. And you have time. Smart. Good style, <laughs> I have no idea how to do a tie. Please, could you describe how you would make pancakes? Oh, I have a really good recipe of pancakes. Mm, tell me, please. Ooh. You get the eggs, you separate the yolk, 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 from the whites. And the whites, you zzz until they become fluffy, okay? And then you start adding the flour, with the yolks, with a bit of extract of vanilla, sugar, maybe a bit of honey to give it a bit more flavor. Mix it all up, but careful when you mix it because you don't want the fluffy stuff to become unfluffy. And then you do them fairly small, but quite tall, so they are fluffy. You cover, so they do a bit of butter on the pan. It's so good. Delicious, and what do you have with your pancakes? Uh, you're gonna call me very strange here. Nothing. I love the dough flavor. I'm like, I like the dough. Can you show us how to whistle with your fingers? No. <laughs> I'll Done make it. it up, but I can't. But I got plaster on. No. I actually saw a video recently. I think you gotta put your tongue to the top of your mouth. I don't know if I can do it though with my plaster. And then... Fingers in. <laughs> I can hardly whistle in general. I'm like, I'm like a real. 
I can. I can whistle. That's, that's all I've got. Can you? <laughs> <laughs> I bought a harmonica. I'm not very good at that either. <laughs> that's the closest thing I can do to performing whistles. Thank you. <laughs> <laughs>